Hi friends, welcome back to another video from Good to Know. So this is a vlog uh, of an unplanned trip to Paradise Beach in Pondicherry. So we started from Chennai about 9.30, drove down through the ECR and reached Pondicherry in the afternoon. So it's an amazing ride on the East Coast Road. So we are fortunate enough to you know spot a yellow beautiful Lamborghini on the East Coast Road. In fact there were a couple of uh, supercars so only managed to capture this one, missed those. And driving for about 3 hours uh, we reached uh, Pondicherry in the afternoon. In fact our plan was to go to the Sand Dunes Paradise where there was quite a lot of uh, water sports adventure activities. And this is about 11 to 12 kilometers uh, from the city limits. However, they say there is, it's about, about 7 kilometers uh, from uh, the city center that is on the Kadlur main road. Once we reached there, since it was an unplanned and an extended weekend, it was terribly crowded. However, we were able to see uh, quite a lot of uh, adventure activities uh, happening there be it kayaking or you know speedboat jet ski and so on and this sandium beach is about three kilometers from the main road since the crowd was more uh, we decided to go to the uh, paradise beach from a place called chunambar where there was boat services uh, to you know the island so we decided and uh, headed to you know the boat jetty which is about 5-6 kilometers from this location. So and then we finally reached the boat jetty which had an ample car park. However it was terribly crowded again because of the extended weekend. So you have primarily two types of ticketing. One is 300 plus taxes of 54 coming to 354 and the other one was you know 260 including the uh, GST. So the difference between the two tickets are on a 354 they do a 20 minutes ride to the island. They let you spend a couple of hours and then you know, they bring you back. And the 260 ticket is about a 20-25 minutes uh, ride where they don't let you get off the boat and it's a uh, speed boat. My recommendation is to go with a 354 where you get a 20 plus 20 to and fro plus a couple of arts there on the beach. And inside in here you have uh, washrooms for ladies and gents uh, not really very well maintained but not bad as well. And then you have a coffee shop, you have an ice cream bottle, you have a small shop where you can you know buy some small uh, clothing like a pants or a t-shirt just in case you need it i wouldn't recommend anything and also you have a nice place for kids to play and this is the ticket counter where you have options to you know pay through credit or debit card and also online bookings available Finally, we are at the entrance to, you know, board the uh, boat. So it's going to be a 20 minutes ride uh, from the boat jetty to the beach, which is sort of an island surrounded by water. Uh, you can see the river coming and, you know, connecting to the sea. And once we start, it's a beautiful ride. Uh, it looks like, you know, the backwaters of an aquarium uh, like Alec. And the coconut lagoons. And you also get to see the fishes jumping. And finally, here we are at the Paradise Beach. So you get down from the boat here uh, and check out the other side, surround the trees. And then you know you walk in from here. Those are the people who come back after the beach visit to board the boat back. This is the crowd you can see. These are the people who are uh, lined up to you know board the boat. And if you walk further down, there are certain small activities such as archery, paintball. 
and on the right side you have a restaurant. And this is the rain dance artificially created, which is not operational currently. And we walk down further. There are a lot of places where they have put the huts where you can, you know, rest, and get some shade in case it's too sunny. Remember to carry your caps. You see these huts, people resting under the shade. And this is the beautiful beach and this is called the white sand you know and uh, honestly I should comment about the cleanliness the beach is very well maintained this is a no plastic zone I couldn't see any garbage and appreciate the people coming in here you know helping them keep the beach clean this is a watchtower so kids enjoy the view from there and that's the boundary to you know divide uh, this beach from the sand dune beach uh, where we've been early so there are security on the either sides and you're strictly not allowed to cross the boundary from both the sides and also inside you have a uh, few activities such as you know quad biking you know bungee jumping horse ride and typically they charge about somewhere around 300 rupees plus taxes for any of the events and also you have a bar inside uh, where you can you know, pick up your drink and walk around drinking and also I did spot a couple of people you know doing uh, para motoring and I was told that it costs you about uh, 2500 for a 15 minutes ride I just wanted to try but then it had, it was on the other side and we couldn't you know, go there for this one activity. It looks to be really amazing. Uh, I regret for having missed this. I'm going to do that the next time and you know, I'll put that on my blog. And finally, the time to, you know, get into the water, have some fun. So I'll pause my video here and then, you know, come back, right back to the boat jetty. Enjoy watching. And one important thing is, you know, these are shallow beaches, so it's safe for the kids to play around. Finally time to you know board the boat and you know return back. So it's again another 20 minutes ride from you know the island to the boat jetty and then take the car and drive back to Chennai.
so that's it so finally we are done with the paradise beach now we are headed towards the rock beach spend some time there have dinner and then drive back hope you got some insight about the paradise beach in pondicherry from this vlog uh, please do share your comments and feedbacks and don't forget to like comment and share thanks for watching take care bye until i see you in the next video